Hello everyone and welcome back to On Point HQ and the TED video in the Bolt Action Basics series. In this video, we're going to be looking at the very basics of HG or high explosive shots. Some weapons in Bolt Action can fire either anti-tank or HG shots. And so it's important that the player outlines what specific type of shot they will be using. HG are more explosive than regular shots and depending on how powerful they are, can deal a lot of damage to multiple models in one shot. In our example, we're going to follow a French medium mortar team firing at a German infantry section. Let's first take a look at the medium mortar stats and outline how these work. We can see the medium mortar can only fire HE. In the special rules, we can see the mortar has a HE 2 inch. But what does this mean? The HE denotes that this is a HE weapon and the 2 inch outlines the shot will have a 2 inch blast radius. It also means the weapon's penetration value is plus 2. On the HE chart in the main bolt action rulebook, we can further see the mortar deals D3 pins rather than 1 to represent its HE power. Some HE weapons are more powerful and will have a greater blast radius, penetration and will deal out more pins. So let's get back to the French mortar team. The shot has hit the German section and now the French player takes the 2 inch template and places this over the section. Any models that fall under the template even partially so, are hit. In our example, the template covers three models, and so the French player rolls 3d6. The German section is raised as regular, and so normally a four or more will be required to cause a casualty. However, as the medium mortar has a penetration value of plus two, this means that the roll of a two or more will cause a casualty. With the roll of a one, two, and a four, this means that two models are removed as casualties. Rather than just causing one pin, the shot causes the section to incur D3 pins. Using a D6 as a D3, a roll of a 3 sees the section incur 2 pins. If a unit that is being fired at by a HE shot has not been issued an order that round, it can choose to go down instead. This action is taken before the shot is fired. If the shot is successful, the template is applied to the section in the normal way, but the number of hits is halved, rounding up. This is to simulate troopers that have gone to ground in an attempt to avoid the blast. If the shot misses, the section has still gone down and cannot activate it again that round. As with the rest of the Bolt Action Basic series, this is just a very brief overview of the HE mechanics in games of Bolt Action. For further information and further rules with regards to different weapons and their HE values and abilities, I would always recommend picking up a copy of the main Bolt Action rulebook. If you have any comments or questions about HE or any other aspect of Bolt Action, please leave them down below and I will certainly respond to all comments and questions. But as always, thanks for watching, do take care, may your dice roll well, and I'll catch you all in the next video. So, bye bye for now.